So Steam just announced this new mobile gaming PC that they're going to be releasing in December. Special thanks to Surge for mentioning it during the live stream today. This thing is looking pretty badass. Um, they they have a really nice price tag, four hundred dollars for the the starter edition of this. I'm pretty sure they're probably gonna have some like pro version or something like that. But um, it's basically just like the Switch, but it plays PC games. And this is something that I've been waiting for for a really long time, and I was wondering when these big game companies were gonna come out with something like this. And it's about damn time Steam is doing it. So that's that's gonna be a big deal or Valve rather. So taking a look at their website here, the Steam Deck, $400 for that starter. And then uh, let's see what kind of specs do they have. Okay, it says uh, we partnered with uh, AMD to create, uh, AMD, <laughs> to create a Steam Deck custom APU optimized for handheld gaming. The Zen 2. All right. So I don't know anything about AMD. I've been Intel and NVIDIA this whole damn time for years. So I'm not really sure what AMD is capable of. I'm pretty sure it's probably close to the same as what Intel and, and NVIDIA could do. But um, I guess we'll see what happens. Um, as long as it's able to play most games this day and age, then it, it will be good enough for me. Um, this gyro thing that's going on right here looks pretty badass. So it's it looks like it's similar to what you would see in the Switch, where you can like move your, your the actual like, pad around. So it has motion sensors, so that's pretty badass. And then they have the, the trackpad on it so that you can use that for your mouse. So whenever you want to navigate and stuff. Could be really nice for playing like MMOs because, uh, you know, recently I was playing a lot of Final Fantasy XIV and I really love the controls in that game. So for them to have even enhanced support with like having those trackpads would be like even better. Green size is uh, 7 inches, so that's not bad. I mean... You know, when it comes to mobile gaming like that, I never really had a problem with the current way the Switch is made, uh, which uh, Nintendo just started working on this whole, um, you know, bigger screen thing for their new generation of, of their Switch, which I don't really give a shit about, honestly. Uh, that's going to be a big pass for me, because uh, Nintendo, the thing, the thing with Nintendo is that they don't really have enough first-party games to really want to jump in on that console, especially when you compare it to... Like, when you have the third-party stuff, and then there's stuff that's, you know, obviously on the Xbox, it's on the PlayStation, it's on the PC, and then it's also on Nintendo Switch. The better option is, honestly, to get anything other than Nintendo Switch, because the processing power on the Switch is just so bad. You're pretty much asking for lag, and you're asking for worse graphics. So, it's it's really nice that the Stream Deck is, is going to be coming, because, or the Steam Deck, rather. Because um, this this could be really awesome for, especially just having mobile gaming, but with all your PC games. Shit, I mean, Steam is my main platform for PC gaming. I don't really care to use the Epic Game Store. I really don't care to use any of that other stuff. So this is going to be really awesome to have that. I just hope that this is more of a PC setup. Like I, I really hope that it's possible to do Windows things inside of it. Probably can't, I don't know, we'll see how this is implemented, but it would be really nice to be able to have some kind of Windows support on there, that way, you know, we could throw on some some emulators and stuff, and we can download mods and download cheats, and, you know, do all the normal, typical PC shit that, um, you know, I'm used to, at least, so, I don't know, we'll see what happens, this looks like a pretty nice deal, for $400, you're getting pretty awesome little setup just judging by the way playstation 5s and xbox series x's have been out of stock constantly i imagine that it's probably going to be the same it's probably going to be a lot of a lot of these scalpers buying the shit out of all the steam decks and then there's going to be none available for like months years who knows so yeah it's probably not going to be a good thing when it comes to that part so we'll see how valve handles that but um this could be a good thing I'm excited to see what this comes out to. Anyways, thanks for watching. Leave a thumbs up if you liked the video. Thumbs down if you didn't. Let me know your thoughts on this in the comments. And I will see you guys on the next one. Later.